Okay, welcome to Scott Saturday. Number one. The first one. Coming to you live from our backyard in Pensacola. We got these nice mugs from Walmart today. They say dream it, do it. So we're going to do it. So we're drinking the famous grouse. Love it. This is Mosquito Central, by the way. So there's This one was $16.99 from Walmart. Seemed to be on the lower end of the shelf. Thought we'd start there. Love it. We're drinking it warm, because that's how Scotch is supposed to be drinking. Drinking. Drunk. Drinking. Two finger rule, right? Isn't that... Whoa. Two fingers you is a stiff your... drink. Well, you got your fingers separated like this. <laughs> <laughs> uh, what story do you want to talk about? Mm. Okay, we have to get through the whole thing. Yeah. <laughs> We still gotta do construction tonight, so oh, this should be a good time. Yeah. Drywall. All right. Um, cheers to uh, the famous grouse with a rooster on it. I think that's a rooster. Cheers to the mosquito spray coming. <laughs> yeah. Getting a fogger. It's <laughs> <laughs> terrible. I don't know why we decided this is a good idea. <laughs> Outside. Oh house. my god. Oof. Did you take a shot? I know. I just put it in my mouth a little bit. Oof. Oh man. That is bad. <laughs> That's not good. To be fair, this could be a really good scotch. We just don't like scotch, so. Well, and it's this really is all warm. for your I, thought, I think you're supposed to, like, I mean, ice I it down. I think that's a little why bit. they say on the rocks, right? I know, but I think on, like, Mad Men and stuff, they drink it straight. Oh my god. I feel like my neck's gonna break just from drinking it. Oh. <coughs> well, this is going great. Yeah, it's really good. Um, what story do we want to talk about? We put up drywall in the house the other day, and it was just Rachel and I trying to hang these pieces of drywall. Oh, ceiling drywall, nonetheless. Yeah, it was terrible. But we did it, and it looks kind of good. Yeah, we haven't, mudded, we haven't put any mud on it yet. <laughs> um... Okay, well, what do you feel on this one? I don't know. We gotta finish it before we give a reading. How about how we ended up in Pensacola? Um, yeah, okay. We, uh, we were in Arkansas. We basically decided we wanted to work on a house and wanted to find a town that we could enjoy while we work on the house and do fun things that we enjoy outdoor things hiking biking fishing things like that um so we first went through nashville um it wasn't really it just didn't feel like the right place right i don't know nashville yeah nashville was okay chattanooga was not okay well yeah but why did we decide not nashville uh, it just, Maybe because it was the first place we were just like, let's see what else is out there. It was super expensive too. Yeah. Um, houses weren't weren't as affordable, and um, it was kind of already an established area. <laughs> yeah, that's true. <laughs> so we went to Chattanooga because it was kind of like a central spot between Atlanta and uh, so Nashville, and right at the Smoky Mountain, like close to Smoky Mountains. But yeah. didn't like Chattanooga either. And then I had done some work down in Pensacola. I love Pensacola. Close to the beach. We had never lived next to the beach. <laughs> I seriously cannot be outside past 5 p.m. These mosquitoes are monsters. Uh, I need to get that fogger out here. <laughs> We're buying a propane fogger. I'm going to Home Depot at 6 a.m. when they open. Uh, um, so we're anyway, down, so we're down here. The houses are super affordable down here. Um, so and it's just the most lovely town. Like honestly, I think people have misconceptions about Florida, and I have not spent one minute here that I haven't enjoyed. The people are incredible, just so friendly, kind, loving people, and it's beautiful. We're a 15-minute drive from Pensacola Beach. Like we can go out there and hang out on the beach, go to the bar. Um, well, not right now, but. Eventually. Eventually. Um, do any water sport you can imagine. Um, we've been surf fishing where you go out. We go out 
right before sunrise and fish off the beach. Um, we bought a crab trap today that we're going to take out and try and catch some blue crab. Um, it's just such a cool little town. I'm really liking it. We've never, either, neither of us has really spent a lot of time near the ocean, so this is kind of all new to both of us, so it's been a fun experience to have together. Agreed. Did you finish your drink? Almost. We're also going to pick up surfing. we got to pick surfing up. Uh-huh. Oh, oh. We might have to switch it. Well, what's another drink that starts with an S? Um, Seagram's? That's a whiskey, but Seagram? You can only do one Seagram's. Maybe instead of Scotch. I guess we're committed now. It's Scotch Saturday. Maybe you I mean, we started at the lower Saturday. middle end. I, I don't know what kind of... Poof, though. God. I mean, I think we need to look up, like, how to drink it. I think maybe just oh. push it back. Because, boy, that was that was rough. This is not everything I dreamed of. <laughs> if you dream it, you can do it. <laughs> if you can dream it, you can do it. You getting the rest of that down there, or what? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Good thing we're putting more drywall up. Um, well, while I finish this, let's talk about all the places we went today. Uh, oh, let's talk about Trader Dan's. Well, yeah, we went, we don't have any tools down here, so we've been trying not to spend full price on tools. So we went to this Trader Dan's in North Pensacola, and he just has random assortment of stuff there. It's like a secondhand and slash antique shop, and he has a whole tool section. So and you just dig through and find the tools you need. They're, it's incredible. You know, 80% off retail, but we they're also, also used. Yeah. We found a, a Sawzall for 30 bucks, a miter saw for 30 bucks. Yep. Everything's pretty much starting at $30 or ending at $30. Yeah, but like we found this single stovetop burner for 10 bucks, and we don't have a stove right now, and we found a $5 pan to put on it. So instead of paying what, $400 for a stove, we got fifteen dollars stove for the meantime. <laughs> Single burner. Just switch out the pans while cooking. Yeah. So that's a lovely little find. I like Trader Dan's. A little bit left. Pump it down. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, it's getting sticky out here. It's hot. Dude. I'm not used to this weather. I love it. It's beautiful and amazing. Don't get me wrong. But like, oh my gosh, my body is adjusting. I'm sweaty everywhere all day, all the time. It does not go away. Um, what else? There's bugs everywhere all the time. They don't die over winter like they do in the Midwest where I've lived my whole life. So We had a swarm of them inside last night. Apparently in May every year in Florida... Um, for a couple nights in a row, these, I don't know, I don't even know what they are. They look like... They look like termites. They look like, well... They swarm your house it, from the, in, from the bones out. So they come in through the walls and then they're like crawling everywhere. And I probably killed 40 within a 20 minute span and I seriously cannot handle it. I need to, like, I need to just adjust. I walk in the bathroom she's freaking out. That's life in Florida. But, I mean, who wouldn't want to live down here? Ugh. Did you finish that? Mm. Oh, a little bit. That was just drops. Finished it. Empty. Did you finish? Yeah. See? No. Oh, okay. Okay. Uh, negative two to two scale. Why don't you go first? I went first on Tequila Tuesday. Uh, negative one point... Six. It was not good. It wasn't like I couldn't like took you know not put it down, but. But did you enjoy that even a little bit? No, near the end there when my mouth became numb. Yes. That's a good standard. Oh. Negative. Oh. <laughs> I just smacked the mosquito off my leg and the blood went everywhere. Okay, negative 2.0. Worst option available. 
that's where I'm at. All right, we might be doing scotch Saturday. We might be doing. I don't know. Maybe we can find we're some doing, Spanish You know what name. we're doing next? Fogger Fridays, where we fog for mosquitoes. Oh, yeah. There you go. Next Friday, you want to fog? Not tomorrow? Oh, no. We're fogging tomorrow. <laughs> fogging every day. We'll just record it on Fridays. <laughs> <laughs> All uh, right. Uh, Scotch Saturday, this was the famous grouse. Gross. The famous grouse. There you go. <laughs> All right. See you next time.